See, Ray ain't so bad after all, y'all. See what I'm saying? Ray ain't that bad. Nice guy, you know? For the most part. Unless you a knucklehead trying to get in my pocket. Good morning, y'all. What in the hell? Man, it is freaking cold, dude. Coldest day of the year for us. Yeah. It's, uh, well, now it done got up to 34 degrees. Man, that shit's cold to me, y'all. There ain't a whole lot going on, y'all. It's just, uh, just slow motion. And, you know. But I'll pick my boy up. See how he's been doing. I know it's been it's been cold out here, man. So you know we'll let him uh, let him do a little something, get a little something to eat. Probably go get a biscuit. Uh, we'll just see how Bo's doing. He might want to go to the shelter or something, man. And if he does, I'll take him down there. Uh, I doubt he'll want to go to the shelter though. Uh, and he ain't gonna get a bunch of money out of me or nothing. I ain't got no work, you know. I'm doing him a favor, y'all, just so y'all know. I'm doing him a favor by going down here and picking him up and getting him out of the cold for a minute, you know. Uh, so, and he ain't got to, you know, he, he, you know, I, I mean, that's where I'm at, dog, so. We'll see how he's doing. He might not even be out here no more. Who knows? You just can't ever tell what, what, what's going to happen when it gets this kind of cold, man. It's a beautiful day, but it's cold, man. We'll, we'll see how Bo's doing it, man. A lot of you guys have been asking me how he's doing, what's he doing, blah, blah, blah. Well, I don't know, dude. I know as much as you guys know. Uh, I know that he ain't got a phone. He ain't done nothing. Ain't nothing changed, you know. Uh, he's just moping around, you know. And if he if he had made $500 yesterday, he'd still be broke. So, you know, and he's, you know, that's how it go with Bo. So... It's cold outside, though, for sure. And uh, we'll get him out of the cold for a minute, you know. Uh, I mean, it's kind of, I mean, you pick your, you, you know, you pick your bed you lay in, man, you know. This is the kind of thing that happens when you're an alcoholic for years and years and you don't, and you don't want to change, you know. So, uh he got a letter to my house and from the court talking about uh so i don't think there's a warrant out on him i mean there might be but i don't think there is because they got a, they did a continuance uh until february or something so he'll be glad to Bo will be glad to know that i don't have it with me but i'll give it to Bo when uh when we go back to the house we're gonna clean out the rest of the garage we're gonna throw some shit on this dump truck. We're gonna get rid of some trash around my house if I don't do nothing else. Cause I will throw them a few dollars, but uh, we're gonna have to get something done, you know. So, and let him ride with me. You know, getting him out of the cold is a big deal, you know, because there ain't no place for him to go during the day. And the, just the mere fact that he's in the truck is, uh, you know, is good for him. He's gonna be over here at the damn coffee shop, though. I bet that's where he's sitting. I told him to ride around nine, and it's eight fifty. See, it's days like this, you kind of feel a little sorry for him. You know what I mean? Because you have to look at it like you know. I know I give him a hard time and all that, but you know he and he brings up all his stuff on himself but if you don't know no better you don't know no better and you know that's kind of where i'm at with him sometimes there he is right there in front of me looking all homely uh-oh uh-oh the boaster y'all What's up, buddy? I was just telling YouTube. I don't know where Bo is. They've been asking about you, buddy. I was right over there. Oh, uh, I see you pull in. At the yeah, I, so. yeah, I was going to turn around and go back down there. How you doing, buddy? All YouTube, all the YouTube world been asking about you. How you doing, YouTube? They know it's getting cold, man. 
Oh man, it was cold, cold, so cold last night. Oh, the really? You want you cold? Get you some heat on you, man. Yeah, my freaking toes were. We got you some heat coming, man. Got you some heat. Just don't take the shoes off. No. Get you, get, get you some damn warm air. I know it's cold out there, dude. Yeah. You got any hand sanitizer? Yeah. What you been doing? Hanging out around here. Oh yeah? Where's your bag and all that stuff? Oh, it's put up. Everything's put up. Uh -huh. uh, well, I really ain't got a whole lot of work, man. You know, I figured that, uh, you didn't eat breakfast? Uh, I had a cup of coffee. I think we'll go up here to. I'm gonna go over there and get a, a sausage biscuit, man, from the Williamson, and then I'm gonna go down to Huckabee's to get some steaks, yeah. and then go to the house, uh, and we got uh, we can throw some stuff on the dump trailer and go to the dump, you know. Anything to get out this weather, you know. But uh, let me see. Yeah, it's warm in here, ain't it? Yeah, Toasty, it ain't it? Get you some of that. Get you some of that heat, ba. There you go. Got you some heat. <laughs> Where's your mask at? No mask. Uh, I think I dropped it somewhere. Oh uh, yeah. What you been up to? Nothing. Just hanging out around town. Needing work. Where you been staying at? Been cold, man. Last Over night. there by the uh, park. By the park. By the church. You staying cold? You staying warm at night? Shoot, no, not last night I wasn't. Hell no, I bet it was freezing, dude. The upper part of me wasn't too bad, but uh, down here at my feet, I need to get some the boot, Are the boots keeping your feet warm? No, because I rode my bike so much, it makes my uh, feet sweat, and then it... Got Where's your bike at now? Put up? Yeah, I got it put stashed. What do y'all been doing? Nothing, man. I didn't do nothing. Yesterday, I took the Bobcat over to... Uh, over to the uh, uh, you know the mechanic you know over in Turin uh, over in Sharpsburg the Bobcat down yeah. there by the trailer place went up to the business office had to get some, sh some, some shit straight with the with the business license and all mm. they uh, the bank wanted me to provide them with some paperwork and I didn't have the paperwork at home so I had to go home and get the paperwork to, uh, uh, for the uh, for the business and uh, apparently this year I've been running the business all year and I ain't had a business license hmm. uh, they didn't uh, they did not penalize me for it because of the corona and everything and they were they were closed for two months and you know blah 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 you know hmm. so I went I went to move some money over to uh, a new account you know for the business and uh, they couldn't finish opening up the new account because of, uh, I didn't have well I didn't have the business license <laughs> you know I didn't even know that, dude. You know, I called a business office, and I thought that that I'd been all all season, you know, without a business license. You know, uh, big complicated mess, man, because of the corona. So she, so then I tried to pay them, and they would only take cash. Yeah, they would only take cash or check. You know, they wouldn't take, they, they can't take a debit card. I, I've never heard of a county not being able to take the freaking debit card. Yeah, that don't even make no freaking sense to me. You know? So, hadn't been making no money. You know, ain't doing anything to make money, but, you know. Uh, but I, I got the dump trailer down there, in the, you know, uh, where it was at last week, you know? Uh, by the in, in 
the driveway and I want to go on and get all the stuff that we're going to put on the dump truck here to the dump. You got a paper from the court too. I did? Yeah, they put that shit off, man, until February. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my God. Isn't that good? Yeah, that's good. I'll, I'll, I'll give you the paper. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you think about going to the shelter? Well, I know they got one in Newton uh, while it's cold like this. But you can't go in until like later on in the afternoon, man. I, I wouldn't mind waiting, you know what I'm saying? Because it's cold as hell. Give me a shower, man. Yeah, uh, you got, what you should do, Bo, <clears throat> is you should go on and go to the shelter for a few days anyway. You know? I mean, because it's going to be cold. I don't know. It's going to be real cold tonight, too. I know. You know? I don't know exactly what it's going to be. But it ain't going to be damn... I'll take you up there, you know, if you want to, you know. I can try. You know, I mean, what, 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 what can they, what can they do to you, know? They ain't gonna tell nobody no when it's them. Let's see what the weather's gonna be like tonight. It's hard to sleep in the second one too, man. Yeah, dude. I mean, it ain't normal, man, for people to be out in the weather, man, like that. Now, if you had a, if you were in Montana around a campfire, well, that's a little bit different. But... So Wednesday morning, damn, dude, 26, 24 degrees. Tomorrow morning, it's gonna be 26 degrees, dude. And then Thursday, see. Thursday. So Tuesday night, tonight, going into Wednesday, it's going to be 23 degrees. Wednesday, it's going to be 25 degrees at night. Then Thursday, it's going to be, go back up to 42. Night. And then Friday back down to 39. Saturday 32. Sunday 32. Monday 29. So I don't see no reason why you couldn't go to the shelter, you know, and be able to stay for at least uh, four or five days, dude. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I know it's going to take you, but we're not making no money out here, no way. There ain't no, I don't nobody want us to do anything in this cold weather, dude. Get over there, get you some rest and everything, and then next week when things when things start tapering off a little bit, we'll, we, I got work, man. I just don't want you to get hurt out here, man. And it's cold, dude. This is dangerous cold weather, dude. This is this ain't just you know. It really it don't hurt you, man. Huh? It don't hurt you. Damn yeah, right, it'll it can kill you, dude. I just last night like freaking bad. I know it can yeah. kill you, dude. So, you know, and... Man, I was wrapped up in a damn rug, dude, trying to keep the wind Yeah, out. but man, this is only so much you can, <laughs> there's only so much you can do, man, you know, without being inside, man, without a fire, a campfire or something. You can't really build a campfire nowhere. You make that cold weather make your heart weak. Keep your heart on if you live Well, it'll it just, well, it just ain't, I mean, it just ain't, uh... got run over dude oh man and now you don't have a phone at all man see, well, see the homeless can... shelter will help you get a government phone and everything dude you know and it ain't like it ain't like you you're missing out on money or nothing because there ain't no money out here dude you know what i'm saying so there's been shootings in there man have you seen huh? there's been shootings in there Seen There's that? always shooting. There's one guy went around and killed like three people, man. They locked him up, though. Yeah. I saw that. Yeah. But I bet you, I bet you, you can go into the shelter. I bet they ain't making people leave the shelter this morning. I bet you they ain't. Where the, where, where's somebody gonna go? It's cold, dude. They're not going, you know.
they put a latch with a lock on there in the barn, man. It had a little heater in there. I go in there in the morning, dude, brush my teeth, and I'm like, man, they put a latch on. He's like, man, nobody can't come in here unless it's on the weekend. And you got to get the key from the office. You don't care if you use it then, but don't no more at night. Yeah, well, that gives people to move in and shit, dude. Jamie, I guess Jamie, Jamie might be in jail down there. He, got, down there he got two batteries. He was supposed to stay away from Allison and then he got an, another simple, so he's probably in the county. He probably out on bond on the other one, wasn't he? Uh, yeah, I wish my aunt would let me freaking come over there, man. She won't? Because I heard she was getting sick. She's got that roommate. She's got a den, man, where Jamie was staying. Yeah, will, she staying. Let you, will she let you do that? I wish I could help her, man. How much money you got? Nine? Zero. Alright, so, uh... Like, there ain't a lot of money. To, I mean, we're not going to be making a lot of money or nothing today. I mean, all I'm going to do is just throw some shit on the dump truck and go to the dump, man. That's all I really got, man. I got, but I got work, man. But nobody wants us to trim, uh, cut these rose bushes back and all that when it's this cold, dude. They're afraid it's going to kill them. All the bushes over there at the uh, day, at the uh, at the pool company's office, <clears throat> right there. Those bushes, the rose bushes, where the sign is, and all that. All that shit needs cutting back. The pompous grass, everything. We'll cut all that shit back and clean out them beds. That's one thing that we can do. But we ain't gonna do it today. It's too cold, man. I'm afraid if we cut them rose bushes, man, and it get to 23 degrees tonight, it might kill them. You know. Hmm. So and that's what they're afraid of too. So. But uh, I would kill them if you cut them like that. Well, I don't know. There's more than just there's more than just uh, rose bushes. Though. We got to cut some of them, some of that evergreen, and you know, I don't know. I don't know. But if they die because we cut them back at you know the coldest day of the year, then that's going to come back on me, man. You know. So I'm going to get me a. I'm gonna get me a biscuit, man. I'll throw you a couple dollars to get you a biscuit or whatever. Here's here's a five, man. All right. Watch out for this guy right here. What you gonna get? Uh, oh, you have you have one goodie powder here? Uh -uh. So I ain't gotta buy one. Uh -huh. I don't know, man. I don't have no goodies, man. All I got, let's see, I got. All I got one. Oh, I got two. Okay. So I guess I'll get uh, grab a biscuit. A biscuit and a coat with three dollars. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. See, I feel kind of sorry for him this time, you know, today, man. You know, I. He just, you know. <clears throat> I don't know why, man, because he puts himself in this in the perils. But but man, it's it's freaking cold, dude. And I hate to damn see something major happen to him out here in the cold, even though he put it on himself. So I'm gonna definitely try to uh, help him out today. Uh, but he's gonna have to help me too. He's gonna have to uh, help me, you know, get just a few things on the dump trailer, you know. Uh, so we can get that out of the way, go on and haul that to the dump. Uh, and then, you know, when we get done, I'll take him, if, you know, because he's not going he's not gonna be motivated to do anything in the street because he ain't gonna have any money. I'm not gonna give him any money, man. He, I mean, uh, and before all y'all come down on Ray, I don't have no work. He knew that when he called me. I picked him up and did him a favor, man. I'm doing him a favor, y'all. So, uh, if he don't get in the truck with me, then he ain't eating. And he's out in the street in the cold at 30 degrees, man. So, you know. I might give him hell, but I don't want nothing to happen to him, you know. Uh, That's why he ain't gonna get no money. Cause see, if I give him, if I if I if I were to give if I were to generate you know an eighty dollar day for Bo, and give him eighty dollars, he ain't going to the shelter. He won't go. 
he'll be in, he'll be hanging in the streets, thinking everybody's his friend until eighty dollars is gone. Then he'll, then he'll wake up in the morning and won't have no money, and uh, he's not going to get any money out of me today. I mean, if Bo get, if Bo ends up getting, uh, you know, I just gave him a five spot just to get him something to eat. Now, if he ends up getting ten more dollars out of me, that'll be good. But I ain't gonna be doing anything either. You know, we ain't got no work, but. I'm just help him get out of the cold. He might be able to help me at the house, you know, throw a couple handful of things on the dump on the dump trailer, you know, might spend 25 minutes doing that, you know. And then, you know, I, I'll go to the dump, but, you know, he ain't got to go to the dump with me, but he ain't got no place to go. So, you know, uh, just because he's with me don't mean he's fitting to get paid. I don't pay guys just to ride in the truck. And he knows that, so uh, I told him that when he called me earlier this morning. You know, yeah, I, 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 I'll find a little something for us to do around the house or something, but uh, ain't gonna be no no big money or nothing. You know, I, and I will take them to the shelter, you know, when we're done, whatever. You know, when I go to the dump, I'll be glad to take them to the shelter. You know, drop them off at the shelter. Because like I was saying, man, you know, it's gonna be cold for the next four or five days. And uh, he needs to get on to the shelter, man, before something happens to him out here on the street, because he ain't gonna have no money. I mean, uh, I'm, sorry, I'm not generating no money. So, yeah. They wouldn't take money from me. Holy shit. Where's it at? Right there. Both there. of you, hair salon? Oh, is it other place right here? Yeah. yeah. It is right there. See, look. 5 to 7 a.m. 5 to 7 a.m., dude. Got Damn. five hours till dinner. Damn. Well, maybe they'll let you in. You never know. Might mm -hmm. have something around here you can do. Maybe they'll let me go ahead and take a shower, man. Wash my clothes. All right. All right, man. I appreciate it, dude. Call me, man. All right. I, I don't... Hey, man, don't look at it as punishment, dude. Look at it as an opportunity to get shit together, dude. Hey, should I ask him, can I get him with my social security card real quick, man, while you're here? All right, good deal. I just, man, you know, I just want the boy to them to get it together, man. You know? So, you know, at least here... You know, whether he comes and works for me or not, I know a lot of you guys think that, well, Ray just using, using Bo and, and all that, man. Bo ain't never got to come to work for me again if he'll get his crap together. You know, that's what I want for him, really, more than anything, man. I want him to get it together, you know. If that's, you know, I, I know he can't do that on his own. So every time he goes into a shelter or a place, then, you know, uh, that's what you want. That's what you want, man, you know. From my perspective, I want him to. I want him to damn get better, man. That's all. Ain't no ulterior motive. Ain't nothing. You know. Uh, ain't deceiving nothing or anything. I want him to get better, man. I want him to damn. You know. I don't know if he can or not, man. But I know for sure he can't if he's on the street down there in our little city. So. Yeah. I drove him up here and uh, made sure that he was able to get into the shelter, man. You know, uh, what more can I do, y'all? You know, so, you know, for all you guys that, that say I'm hard on Bo, I might be, and I might, and I, I will admit, y'all, I might cross the line sometimes, I, I, I will admit, but man, it's frustrating when you got him out here with you, and, you know, and you see how good he works one day and how bad he works the next day, you know and all that you know it's that's that's where i'm coming from you know i just want the boy to get better man and and, and if getting better uh, means he don't work for me well i that's okay you know I, you know it's it's deeper than work you know he needs help man and when it's cold like this i, I feel sorry for him dude and i might be old softy feeling sorry for him but man it's cold out here dude it's 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 it's, it's really cold y'all <laughs> so yeah doing the best i can man peace out y'all